Alright, what am I gonna do here? There's just way too many Bonites! Holy shit! Alright, I don't think I want Melody to go over there anymore. <laughs> that fell apart rather quickly. Iron Sword this guy. Alright, good deal. Hmm. Alright. Now then, to steal his elixir. I'm gonna have Alan go over here, probably go all the way over here, and what do we got here? Armor Slayer, Lance Reaver, ooh, perfect! I like those odds. No Lance Reaver for you. E. Let's I make him level 6. Yep. Some strength, speed, luck, good deal. Good level up. Alright, now time to steal your shit. Actually, does anyone have anything else cool I can steal? You have a vulnerary, I don't care about that. Thanks. Oh yeah. It's always nice to steal shit. Now, if I'm careful, I can probably take care of every single one of these guys. I'm probably gonna want to go for you. Boom! Luna's a scary force. Scary. Seriously, look at look, look at that attack. Fucking seven. <laughs> it's just it's not even fair, guys. It's not even fair. Alright. I'm gonna want Percival over here, I guess. Yep, you can visit them all. Aw shit. This is gonna take a while. Yeah, let's go with that. Yo. Kind of surprised the Armor Slayer doesn't work on people like Paladin. I'm kind of glad it doesn't, but I'm also kind of surprised if that's the case. Anyway, go over here, kill you. Eh, let's go for you. Yeah. Man, I wish there was a whole pair up option, but there is not. Not until Awakening. It's very useful to have the pair up option. Just saying that right now. Alright, now what do we gotta do? Well, I wanna have blue near Chad still. So right here. And let's kill the shit out of you. You. Lou, stop getting criticals, goddammit! He's gotten like a hundred in a row, I swear. His last chapter, now this chapter, he just will not stop getting criticals. The first time I'm commenting on, on yeah, commenting on it, but seriously, enough with the criticals. All right, steel axe time. I could sort of Boars do a good bit of this shit because he really can't even be hurt by anything except for these like shamans. Everything else he can pretty much handle mostly on his own. Like the bows, they don't do shit because they're all short bows. Especially when he has even more defense now. At least that was a general base level up. Alright, let's go for Steel Sword. Oh! And finally, we pretty much cleared out that entire area of units, except for this guy. But he's not going to be too threatening once he hits his own missile fours, whatever he decides to do. No, he misses. Alright, good job, boys. <sighs> Man, it's great having this fucking day off. That's all I gotta say. It's been way too long since I've had a day off. I just want a break, guys. I'm sorry. Working 35 hours a week is fine and all, but... You know, I'd like to do it without working just 5 or 6 hours a day. I'd like to have 35 hours a day be like 5 days a week, 7 hours. I'd be okay with that schedule, giving like two days off. I'd be perfectly fine with that schedule. In fact, that's generally what I work. I work five to close. And you know what? I'm like, that's kind of stupid, but whatever, I'll take it. I don't want five every fucking night for six days in a row. Or six, I don't care what it is. It's just like, guys, I want a break, man. I want a freaking break. Oi. And of course, Air Caliber fails me. Because it breaks. Wow. I just realized. What can these guys even do? 
Like, I mentioned boars, but can they hurt anybody? I don't think so. I think Melody's the only one who they can realistically hurt. That's it. Now I get the feeling I'm about to get interrupted again. Oh boy, I love that. Well, I'll keep going until I get interrupted, officially. My interruption senses are tingling. Wow, desperate to really attack me, aren't you? I'm surprised I can actually double him. I know I'm a hero and all, but he's also a pneumatic trooper. Hmm. Alright, this guy needs to stop. Right now. I hate this guy so much. Give me like 30 HP, too. I hate you so much. Alright, now how to deal with all these guys? Hmm. Well... I could put people to sleep. Pretty much anyone I want with 100% accuracy. Look at that shit. Just everyone. Perfect accuracy for that crap, too. I don't think I want to do that, though. I think I want to go heal some people. Actually, you know what? I don't even need to do that. I'll just divine this guy. Perfect. Wait! God damn it! Second tries to charm. Thank you. Alright, sorry about that, I'm back. Now then, what was I doing? Man, this this is one of those moments where I really wish Ojue had a hand axe so he could clear out all these shit bitches right here. I think I'm gonna have Mr. Al Sword these guys. This is also a moment in which I wish the Al Sword had a critical hit chance that was not two. Wow. Well, you know what? Alright, I'll, I'll take that. I'll take a critical out of complete bullshit luck. I'm perfectly fine with that. Hmm. I have an idea. I'm gonna bolting somebody. Who am I gonna bolt? Who would be a good target for my bolting? Probably... Yeah. Actually... I think I'll go for you. Why not? Alright, make sure you hit this, Lou. I know you have an 89. Thank you. Do not waste bolting usage. Now, the reason I did this is to kill a unit and also give a point for Elfin to actually run up and give someone a singing lesson. Twitter bird. Show me the Twitter bird. Yeah, Twitter bird. I fucking love Twitter bird. Alright, let's go. Now we run up here, equip both our lightnings so we don't, uh... And... I choose you. Yeah, I didn't really care who I attacked there. In fact, this was probably the best person to attack because he's hiding in the bushes, and I want someone accurate like Lou. Right. Perfect. Okay, now we probably want Boris to deal with this guy. Can I deal with that guy? Why? Okay. How about you, Melody? Well, these guys are kind of hard, and I want Melody to do something, but unfortunately, there's just way too many bow users. I think she can probably do her best work over here if I could just clear this guy out of the way. Oh, that'd be someone like Luliana's job. But I think she'd be better spent right there. I don't know. Actually, you know what? She needs to be able to kill someone in one hit. That's what she needs to be able to do right now. And she's very close to being able to do it against a lot of these guys. Wait, she can't even double the fucking... Oh, right, right. They have a lot of speed. That doesn't make sense, actually. Alright. Well, no, you really need to get some speed. That's all there is to it. You're just too slow. I mean, you're as fast as boars. Lilina. You're eight levels higher, and you're as fast as boars. Don't you get... Oh, wait, wait, actually, no, you aren't. Uh, I'm just completely wrong about that. Uh, I mixed up their speed for a second. So let me. And what do we got here? Alright. Steel Lance, Steel Lance, Axe Reaver. Alright, that's not bad. First of all, you'll take care of the guy with the Axe Reaver, with your Sword Reaver. Haha, <laughs> reversing the triangle even more, bitches. Look at that shit. Yo. 
And Percival's turning out to be so much better than both Zealot and the, the other guy whose name is so Garrett. Garrett, there we go. I'm sorry, Garrett just sucks. <laughs> like, Zealot sucks, Garrett sucks, Percival is turning out to be damn useful. That's how it is. Alright, Melody. Um. Javelin it is. Please hit both of these. That's a lot to ask, but you can do it. Good job. Alright, that makes me a lot safer now. So now I can sort of just damage control. What am I going to do over here? Alan can take care of this guy if he gets lucky. Alright, Alan, let's see if your luck pulls through. Come on, man. Yeah, Alan. Yeah, buddy. Alan rocks it. Alright. Roy, I don't want you to get too much experience, so I'm going to have you take care of this guy. Yo, that's my critical, bitch. Alright. Chad, do you almost have your support? No, you don't. Just continue sticking to your Lou and uh, do a little bit of damage. Or not. Whatever, I don't really care. Hmm. Alright, I sort of put Elfin in danger again. Well, I guess I better damage control these guys. And by that I mean sort of just block them off from hurting anyone else. God damn it. Alright, well, looks like I'm unfortunately going to have to pull out Shin's super duper silver bow. Which I don't like to do because it's really freaking powerful. Actually, wait a minute. Eh, yeah, I should probably pull out the super duper silver bow. Oh well. I don't like to pull it out also because he has an F already. Yeah. And that's where Shin gets most of his power from, that goddamn silver bow. Look at that shit. So powerful. Some skills, some HP, alright, whatever. Now let's see what Elfin's going to do to survive. Or probably just dodge everything again. You go after Percival all you want, he's pretty much set to kill you all. Look at that, he doesn't even care. He's actually good. He's, he's actually a usable. A pre-promote in this game that's actually usable. Like, Jesus. Who thought that'd be possible? I certainly didn't. And someone's actually going for Chad. Good thing he has a lot of luck for a thief, surprisingly. Hmm. Alright, now it's probably... Oop, clicked off screen. Now it's probably going to be the nomadic trooper's turn to come over and start stabbing me with whatever shit he has. If he can even reach me, he might not be able to. That makes me sad that you can't hear the sound effect for that. Wah, 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 wah. E. Jupe. Oi. Man, I love these short bows. That's all I gotta say. They're great. Their critical hit chance is the best part about them. Alrighty then. Just everyone going after poor Chad. He's avoiding all of them, mostly because he's in the forest and his, his avoidance is freaking ridiculous. Oh. My. Lord. You are a dick, sir. Righto. Let's deal with these guys somehow, shall we? Of course I can hit a single freaking one of them. I mean, I can put one of them to sleep, but I don't want to do that. I don't want to save that. Because that is going to be super useful against some enemies later on. Anyway, Audrey, get some experience with your axe. You'll almost have a C in it, and once you do, you'll be able to weave that killer axe I bought. Yeah. That is level 8. You'll level up. Actually got some resistance. Alright, what to do now? Um. Ah, perfect. That's actually killing range for boars. If he gets incredibly lucky. Oh, you know what? Fuck, it's a 50 chance either way. Nice shot, boars. Go on! Hmm. How about you, Chad? No, you are not fast enough. Probably because you have that steel sword. 
and it's weighing you down a lot. Alright, well, I can have Lou do something, I think. Except you only have one use left of your Lou Thunder. Yeah, I should probably just go for regular Thunder then, if I'm going to do that, though. Shin. Actually, I have a perfect idea. I'll have Shin take care of both of these guys. I'll have good old Elfin. Give him a little bit uh, more dance ability. Or whatever, just give him more movement. Alright, let's do that. And this way, Elfin will also be protected. Nice job, Twitterbird. Alrighty then. Yeah. Oh, click the screen. God damn it. Okay then, what do we gotta do now? Um Well Look, how many enemies we got left? We got nine strong. Alright. If I could just take out a unit for every single unit I have. I should be able to get us pretty damn close to being almost done with this chapter. There we go. Alright, now we're down to eight. But this should be, should be down to seven if nobody can take care of one of these guys, which he should be able to do easily. Yep, look at that. Yeah, eat it. Gotcha. Down to seven. Well, oh, click off screen again. God damn it. Alright, number six should be Lilena. Six. Alright, to get down to five, we'll have Roy take care of this guy. Actually, no, we'll have Pert. Eh. What can Roy do? Roy can go take care of this guy, actually. Or, no, he can't. Well, he almost can if he gets a really lucky critical like Ojoy did. There we go. Ow. That hurt a lot. Alright. Now I'll go for him. And with this we should be down to five. And now finally to get down to four. We'll have Lou kill this guy. Or not. Oh crap, he actually can't kill him. I did not even notice that. Holy crap. That was stupid of me. Uh oh, that actually puts Roy in a little bit of danger, believe it or not. Because all I can move is Chad. Yeah. Hmm. I'd have to get a lucky critical with Chad or something like that. Unless this guy would be easier to kill. Well, he'd almost be. Actually, does that really put Roy in danger? No, not really. I mean, it kind of does. I have faith in Roy's ability to survive. Alright. Stab this guy. There we go. Maybe we attract a little bit of the attention. Alright, let's see what happens. Yeah, they're going after Roy. And he missed. Alright, I'm good. Four. And he's literally going for the steel sword. Oh, he wasn't even in danger anyway. Actually, yeah, he was, wasn't he? Because he would have done 11 to him. Yeah, he actually would have been in danger. <laughs> and here comes the eclipse. About time. But we're down to only three units now. Oh, what do we got left? Yep, just these three right here. Time to go visit the villages. Alright, first one. Yoink! Clan shall go on a defensive arc to fend off invaders. That is the law of Stacia. Wait a minute. Oh no, they just tell you about the laws of Stacia, don't they? Enemies shall face the wrath of our fellow clansmen. That is the law of Stacia. Oh, right. In other words, it's kind of pointless to visit the villages. Great. All the clans shall unite to defeat invaders. That was the law of Stacia. Yeah, I'm not even going to give these guys accents. I'm just going to read them. Uh, 
It should probably heal boy up. Should have done that in the first place, but whatever. Well, I have to go drive my sister to my to her girlfriend's house. Uh, I will be right back. We forgot I had to go do that. But yeah, yeah, be back. Alrighty then, I'm back from dropping off my sister. It is now 2.15, so that took like 30 minutes about, somewhere around there. I also went, stopped by CBS, picked up some things, mostly my lunch. Also got some chocolate milk. Mm. Yes. Fucking love chocolate milk. I'm not sure why I keep getting chocolate milk lately. I got some at Burger King and now I got some right here. I don't know. Chocolate milk. Good stuff. It's been a while since I've had chocolate milk, you know? Uh, had to have it again. That guy needs to die. Um, that's, that's all that needs to be said about that. So I'm going to go send Killer X guy all the way down here and take a quick look and see. No, you really can't visit these other houses. You visit all these other houses, they give you shit all, and then the circle of houses you yeah, really can visit. Completely pointless. Thanks, game. Love it. Unfortunately, this guy's a Lance Reaper, so this is going to have 46 feet out of that. Shit. Alright, get over there then. Quick grind sword. Rush you over here. There's about a good spot. And basically we're all just going to converge on the boss now. Of course, we're probably just going to end up getting ambush spawned, so it's going to be complete bullshit. So, yeah. Good times. Might as well... Actually, you know what? I'm going to have you rush out. Then I'm going to move you forward. Yeah, there we go. I can have Saul go heal some people again. Good deal. Been a little bit, Saul. Go to bird. Alright, get down there, man. Go heal some fools. Actually, you can't heal anyone. Uh, you can heal Chad. There you go. This takes up the whole screen, lags the recorder a little bit. Good times, recover. Level 11. Yeah, you usually find your healers are going to level up the fastest, because seriously, you use them for like healing and attacking, that's like double the usage. It's especially when they level up that they become like super useful. Like they're the best units once they level up, they become like a lot more important once they level up. Because then they can heal so much more, they can, uh, they can attack, so you can throw them out into the front lines. Like it's a pain in the butt leveling them up when they're like not able to attack, but afterwards they just start to go fast. You can keep trying, man. It's not gonna work. I don't even understand what you're aiming for Melody in general. Like, I think you have chances to hit other people like Luna. Because she's got shitty speed. Actually, well, she's faster, but also you also have a weapon triangle advantage over her, so you might still be able to hit her. Oh wait, no you won't. You have a 32. Alright, let's run through all the enemies and... Well, all the guys we have, and see so you have the ability to hit. You can hit absolutely nobody. I'm being dead serious. You cannot hit a single one of us. Maybe, maybe Lilina, but that's a stretch. So I'm gonna say no. Yeah, uh, you can hit nobody. Good one. Alright, let's visit this village. I think this is the last one. Pray daily to the sky and earth. That is the law of the Stacey. And those are all the laws of Stacey. Stacey is kind of a boring place. Alright, time to kill everyone. Hmm. Who needs the experience the most? Probably Melody. Get him. That eclipse also weighs a shit ton, so. Yeah, you're basically sacrificing all your avoid. Good job, buddy. Good job. Good job, Juke. And level six. Awesome, I'll take that. That's a great level up. Strength and speed. That's everything you need. That was unintentional run. And of course, this guy's being an asshole again. I might have Luke kill the boss again. He's level five. Hmm. How about Boars? What can Boars do? Your defense is 21. His attack is. Oh my God! He can do shit all to Boars. <laughs> Unfortunately, he can quadruple boars, which is not exactly pleasant. Or can't... No, no, he can't. Because he's actually weighed down by his own weapon again. In other words, he can't quadruple boars, he can only double boars. Oh, what the fuck? 
Wow. Nice one, game. If Chad didn't have enough luck, he could have possibly been, like, critical there and... Oh, that's just a mess of shit right there. You know what's going to happen? Every turn they're going to spawn out of those houses now. Every turn it's going to be, like, two different houses. I better finish this up right quick. Alright, Roy, get your ass over there. We need to finish this up right now. I don't think I'm going to have time to wait for boars. This is stupid ass. Alright, Melody, get in there. What can you do? You can double him, and Luke, can you, you can also double him. I know for a fact you can. Oh shit, no you can't. Why can't you double him? Look at your speed, man. Oh, come on! One short. How about you, Percival? What can you pull off? You can pull off a critical if you're a lucky son of a bitch. What about you, Liliana? Um... You rival him in speed. So you know what? I'm gonna have you rush down there, then. Alright, Melody. Get over there. And, uh, yeah, you are probably the one who will best be able to take this guy down. Yeah, that's what it's looking like. I don't want to... Yeah, I'll give you some sword usage, why not? Although I'm getting the feeling that if I do this... I'm right into our trap. Yeah, I know what it's going to be. I'm going to constantly attack this guy. And then she's going to get ambush spawned by a bunch of nomadic troopers, and they're just going to fuck with me. It's going to be great. In other words, time to cover. Um, I should probably not do that. I should really equip Thunder so I don't get, like, double attacked by anything. Next up, cover all the ones that we can that are close enough to this. Alright. They're probably going to come from those two, so it's just going to be stupid anyway, but whatever. Um... Can you get another lucky critical like you got last time? I mean, that was really lucky. Nope. Eh, we can do not. I just need to make sure Chad's out of danger. And he should be for the most part. Saul, so kill that guy. Um, you almost can. Unless you get a lucky critical. Oh yeah. Alright, now Chad can deal with him. Good job. Okay, where are you at? Um, you were not very far close. Actually, you know what? What I can do is an even better idea. Go here. Sing you up. Twitterbird. <laughs> At least I'm not tired anymore. I guess driving helps not make you tired. I don't know, that's weird. Go kill him, by the way, Shin. Thank you. And now, we can have Chad continue his support conversation with Lou, as long as they can get his support up. I really hope that was not a mistake. Alright, find out nomadic troopers where they're going to spawn. Oh my fuck. Everywhere where I couldn't have covered. You sacks of shit. What the hell was that? Is someone home? Oh, cool. Once again. Really? Twice in a row, Melody. Well, not brave sword guys going on probably like critical or something stupid like that. Alright. Well, I'm still alive. That's how Dublin really should be, buddy. Alright, what's gonna happen now, I wonder? I have to wait and anticipate. And they're going after Chad. I sort of expected that. But I'm guessing this other pneumatic troop is gonna go after Millie. <clears throat> which is going to be a real pain in the butt. Because he's probably gonna do a lot of damage or critical for her, something stupid like that. Yeah, look at that. I could have died very easily there if he got a critical. That is some pretty big horseshit. Okay, Liliana, um, I'm gonna hope that your support with Roy is enough. And it looks to be enough. I just have to get pretty lucky, come on. Let's do it. Yeah, gotcha. Oh, oh good you defeat us. My calculations were flawless. Just enemy butt spam. That's literally all he did, he just ambush spawned. Congratulations, it was not a flawless plan. It failed pretty miserably. Alright, time to damage control for as much as we can. Get as much experience as we can before we have Roy just end this whole chapter off before more ambush spawning happens. I'm guessing just because the boss is dead, no more ambush spawning is going to happen is not the case. I wish it was. I really do. And there's a D with swords. Awesome. That's what I like to see. Alright, Percival, get in there. And you got your javelin. Actually, you have a hand axe. Sweet. Completely forgot you had one. You might be able to take this guy, lucky. Damn it. 
Well, you tried, Percival. Then you got some hand axe or some axe usage. What are you looking like? Good, good, good. That's what I like to see. Alright, Ojoy. Um, do you two have your support yet? No, you don't. You almost do. I'm guessing. It will be there eventually, someday. Some way. Good job, Ojoy. Let's see if we can get Boars to kill. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if that's possible. Oh, boy. Alright, Boars, go kill him. Um. Go for it, Boars. God damn it. 